Right, so uh, we're in the Suzuki Splash now. This is the uh, GLS spec and it's a 1.2 litre four cylinder engine. Only got 45,791 miles on the clock. It's got full service history. Last service was not long ago. Car drives very nicely, no noises underneath at all. turning circle on these if you live down a tight street or anything um, or you're going to city lots of park really good turning circle
not, there's barely any um, stone chips on the bonnet, which can be indicative of uh, a lot of motorway use. Um, with you know the highest cars flicking through. Yeah, so currently on the live miles per gallon reading, we're just doing 60 miles per gallon just then. So I've just set the, the other one, the other uh, average, and we'll see what we get on the way back. You should expect, like I say, 50, 55 miles to the gallon without a problem. That's through the gears, lovely. Like the steering as well it's actually nicely weighted so it's not too light you get steering that's too light on cars it's not nice for when you're doing higher speeds but this is light enough for the both higher speeds and around town you can see how light the steering is nice and accurate the steering if that makes sense so yeah you can see this is really really nice car to drive as i say it um, it's just everything uh, is great great on the car full service history and it shows so thanks very much for watching guys, I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and start the engine. These engines tend to be a little bit sort of tappity when they first start, but once they're warmed up they just run as smooth as a little um, electric sewing machine. So I'm really really smooth little engine. The uh, belt down now uh, looks very clean. Uh, it looks like it's fairly new as uh, the battery as well looks like it's nearly new. All the levels are absolutely fine on it. I've checked all those over. No smoke or anything like that obviously and uh, That's just vapour. You can see it disappears if it was smoke it'd hang around. It's just with the exhaust system still being cold. I'm say it revs very cleanly. Let's put that on, put the lights on. Okay. Alright, so this is the 2010 Suzuki Swash. This is the 1.2 litre and it's in the GLS spec. This is a lovely little car, low mileage and um, it's been well looked after, full service history. Very straight bodywork, no dents or heavy scratches and a um, couple of very minor scuff marks which I'll point out but can see like from the mirrors and stuff they're in re really nice condition no chips or s no chips or uh, cracks in the screen <clears throat> paint works lovely it's a turquoise color quite unusual but really really love this color you can see from the back there's no heavy scuffs or anything Again down the side, no dents. Great shape this car, really really cool little thing. No uh, dents on the roof. And even door handles are uh, colour coded as well which is good instead of just being black plastic. Uh, this is the GLS spec. So I think it's a, uh, like a mid spec. <laughs> You can see there's no heavy stone chips on the, the car, on the bonnet. There's one one here, and that's the only one. Um, there's no scuffs on the front or anything. Really, really fabulous colour. You see the lights are in good condition as well. Nice and clear. Very bright little lights as well for down country roads, etc. I'm surprised at how bright these are, actually. 
So there are a couple of little marks here and there, sort of down at the bottom here, there's one. It's been touched up with a paint pen. Um, one there. But um, considering the edge of the car, it's in fantastic condition. Really, really nice. Um, one here as well. Well, actually, that's coming off. I think that might be. Oh, I think that's. <laughs> I think that's polished actually. Um, so let's go and show you the tyres. The tyres have got lots and lots of tread left on them, which is always nice, especially as it's still um, January now. You know, we've still got February and March to go for winter. So you can see they've got lots and lots of tread left. Okay, we'll show you the the door cards now, and this is what I refer to as door cards. And uh, the sills, no rust or heavy wear at all, showing the mileage of the car. Seats are in great condition, really, really nice. Okay, let's go to the next one. You see no heavy scratches or anything. Just a couple of marks here and there, but nothing, nothing major. Again, you, the rear seat literally looks like it's never been sat in. <laughs> very, very clean. The carpets underneath the mats are immaculate. Which are always nice to see. It's got roller windows for the rear, but uh, that's okay. Again, you can see there's no heavy marks on the door. Door shut nice and easily, and you have to put. Yeah. There you go. And again, seat this side, no marks or um, anything like that on them. I really like the matching interior as well. It's great. And again, you can see on the door. All very clean and tidy and uh, underneath the mats, just immaculate carpets, really really nice, headlining's immaculate, you can see the dash as well, really really nice condition, no scratches or anything on that, uh, same on the doors, okay let's have a look in the boot, uh, boot's actually a decent size for a, a little car, you can fold the seats down 60-40 uh, split, got a little parcel shelf which is in great condition, little mark here but nothing nothing major. Underneath here is a, a really big uh, box so you can store loads of stuff in there. If you went out for a trip and you wanted to hide a few things in there, valuables or whatever you know, bags etc. Um, also uh, you can put your wet gear in there, um, umbrellas and jackets and things. Spare looks like it's brand new. It's the original uh, space saver with the toolkit. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, we'll get in the car now. So the car's only got 45,790 miles on, which is absolutely nothing. Starts cleanly. Let's put the side lights on so the dash lights up. I love this funky rev counter at the top. The engine's still pretty cold, which is why it's idling a little bit high at the minute. So, yeah, very, very clean and tidy. You've obviously the glove box, it's got the original owner manual in, which has also got the uh, booklets in, the warranty, uh, not warranty, sorry, service booklet, owner's manual uh, in the wallet. Steering wheel is very, very clean, no heavy marks or anything on it. And this one's got, because it's a GLS model, it's got the controls of the stereo on there. So, 
you can do the volume up and down you can change to different uh, stations etc and um, really good little storage area for your phone or something like that in there you could probably sit a little cup of coffee on there or something um, put some snacks in there <laughs> show you all the stuff working there you go indicator left and right lights on full beam so stereo all works and everything all of these work circulate air conditioning and the uh, rear uh, heated window not sure whether the air condition works it's winter it's very hard to tell really um, gear shifter is very clean indeed as you can see no wear on it at all which is really nice and um, it's just very clean and tidy car this comes out so you can put your coffee cup in there it's not been used for smoking in the car is just very clean it's just been used to put rubbish in now you, put this, you can actually sit a phone in there nicely I did that um, while driving it you can see all the all the controls light up as well hot air comes up comes out nicely car warms up very quickly which is nice for winter it's got a couple of buttons here which are your lights you can hear those working and a traction control on and off which comes on there there's no lights on the dash these are just a uh, handbrake and that's obviously the seat belt engine revs cleanly no problems there at all very nippy little car this really fun to drive it's got a uh, lock buttons for in the car which all work it's got uh, electric well, power adjustable mirrors you can see they both work and the good thing is these are actually heated uh, to get the heated uh, mirrors on you just press the rear heated windscreen and that's how they heat up get rid of uh, sort of you know mist on them or ice or whatever in, in winter always a nice thing to have and uh, it's got an automatic full uh, down window and then so both of these open cleanly no noises or anything and um, yeah just the everything works really well on them as well the real one uh, it's just got rear fog light you can see that comes on so I think that's about it really I would say that the the, the stereo is decent on it the speakers are pretty decent actually I was quite impressed with that and um, yeah just a really really lovely car this is a, you absolutely 100% tell that it's been looked after and I think it's only had one previous owner I will check on the paperwork but you can pretty much tell that um, it's not had many owners because of the condition of the seats and stuff so yeah really really genuine nice little car this and uh, whoever buys this will be very happy with it fuel economy is good as well oh uh, yeah you've got if you just use this button here so you can see obviously it's your normal trip meter but then you've got your live miles per gallon reading average that has just been sat there warming up so it does about 50 miles to the gallon plus on a motorway depending on your speed that's nice, obviously your range fuel range as well so yeah i think that's that's everything guys thanks very much for watching